Brighton, Bradford Disability Football Club, BDFC, are pleased to announce as the Keeley as a new community partner. Uh, BDFC player Nick Kitchen has rallied the support of his manager, Paula Watson, and his colleagues to raise both funds for his beloved club through the ASDA Community Life Program. A, um, a weekend of events to celebrate beginning begin raising awareness and funds started um, on Saturday um, 15th at Valley Parade as Nick and Paula will um, join other BDFC players as match sponsors um, will sit pitch side to support the League One teams playing on the pitch at half time. Um, former Bantam strike, striker Ian Ormondroy, chairman of the Bradford um, Disability Football Club and community officer for Bradford City, said the Gillingham game couldn't be better timing to announce the news as it is the first day of Level Playing Field's Weeks of Action campaign, um, a charity devoted to campaigning and supporting disabled football fans. Um, Nick, who works as, as the Keeley um at Asda Keeley has received unwavering support from his employer um, who have accommodated a change in hours to allow him to attend training and league games and additionally supporting BDFC through the store is fantastic um, Sunday 16th of March um, there was the first of many events starting with a backpack and fun day um, be it, that was held at Asda Keeley store to start um, the fundraising and community activities BDFC coaches and special guest Billy Bantam were on hand for football in football fun sessions fun football sessions in the car park and Ian Armondroid Sticks of the Pulse was attending um, to pack the first shoppers bags with Nick um, at 11 a.m. Paula Watson store manager said the community life program encourages every Asda store to play an active role in the life of their community from raising money for local charities to volunteering our colleagues take their responsibilities towards their local community very seriously as lifelong Bradford City fans me and my husband watched Bradford City disability team play and was thrilled by seeing how much it meant to Nick and our fellow City fans to play at Valley Parade we could see what a positive impact the club can have on people's lives. Nick and I told the store team about what I saw on Saturday and asked and asked my store team to help. From then on, my store team have worked alongside BDFC to build um, a plan to help raise money and grow awareness of this truly great cause in our community. I encourage you all not just um, think of your Asda store as a supermarket, but a center for your community. Come on, city. Um, Nick Kitchen was born with hydro hydrocephalus water on the brain um, they drained the water by inserting a valve which still remains embedded in his skull Nick suffered complications and was left with permanent disabilities apart from his evident height and child size he is only partial, partially sighted growing up um, Nick being smaller and less able bodied than his peers was unable to play the game he loved so much due to fear um, he has described the experience as terrifying um, Nick started playing at BDFC having met a number of the players who came to Bre who come to Bradford for City um, matches together already. His league debut was on the pitch at Valley Parade at the Colchester game where he scored. Nick said, I regret now that I did not play football before. I am so proud and privileged to play for BDFC. It is, it's a dream come true. It's one of the best things I've done in my life and one of my greatest achievements. I've been made very welcome. My teammates and friends and everyone works together. They are like a family. Um, I, could never, I could never thank enough the coaches and players for giving me this opportunity. Bradford Disability Football Club was founded in 2002 um, with an initial grant of £1,000 and eight players. Now it has over 100 members aged from 6 to 60 and is growing in its profile and its membership every year. The Disability Club is a, is a part of the Bradford City FC Community Foundation and the club chairman is Ian Ormondroid, ex-Bradford City um, player, also known as Big Sticks for those who listen to Pulse Sport on match days. Now you know what? I want to give a huge shout out, huge huge shout out to Bradford City Disability FC. Massive shout out, massive massive shout outs, and um, also also a huge shout out to Jamie Dorward as well, who um, got in touch with us via um, via Twitter as well. Twitter. Big big shout outs, big 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 time shout outs to Bradford City Disability Football Club. <laughs> Yeah.